Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So as you understand, this is about the information science engineering branch and what are the typical subjects you will study in each semester as per the VTU syllabus. Right? So let's start. So first and sem uh, se second semester has similar subjects. So it is clubbed together, right? So if you, you will study calculus, differentiation, equation, engineering, physics. So in semester one, it will be engineering physics one. Then in semester two, it will become engineering physics two, basic electrical engineering, civil engineering uh, elements or basics of mechanics. Then you have engineering visualization, engineering physical laboratory labs basically, engineering lab, electrical labs, physics labs basically and in communicative English which will also be taught in both the semester first and second and then advanced calculus numer numerical. So it is almost like uh, the subjects which are there in the class 12 or PUC syllabus and uh, you also have innovation and design thinking or scientific foundation one of those you have to take similar to engineering physics you will also have engineering chemistry uh, basics of electronics and communication elements of mechanical engineering chemistry laboratory and so on so not everybody will have to take everything every there will be only five papers per semester so you will have to choose from this options right Similarly, there will be the chemistry lab, there will be computer programming lab and there will be professional writing skills in English. So this is what is covered in the uh, first and second semester which is common across all the engineering branches. Now I will come, come to the third semester. So in third semester information science engineering ISE, you will study mathematics for computer science, digital design and computer organization, operating systems, OS data structure labs uh, and uh, then your data structure using C, C++. You can also see course and the course codes are also mentioned again each of this. Then there will be you know options between you know subjects like ESC, ETC, PLC. Then common subjects like social connect and responsibility. Then ability enhancement courses. I will talk about skill enhancement course courses. What are the options available at the end? Then you have between NSS, physical education and yoga, you have to select one of the, them. So you can see total nine of them are there and you. Now if you see this is the fourth semester. In the fourth semester you will study analysis and design of algorithms, advanced Java, DBMS and analysis and design and same ESC and ETC, PLC between them. Ability Enhancement Courses 4 Then there is a course called Biology for Engineers and uni Universal Human Value Course and again between National SS, NSS, U Physical Education and Yoga you have to select one. Now it is like 5th semester. So in 5th semester almost similar to like CSC. CSC also has the same subjects. CSC also has Software Engineering and Project Management, Computer Networks Theory of Computations, Data Visualization, Professional Elective Course, Project and Environmental Studies NS, uh, and one of them like NS, NSS, Physical Education or Yoga. So you see many of the subjects at least 70 to 80 percent are common between CSC and Information Science Engineering. Same of subjects were also there in CSC. Now if you move to 6th semester, there also full stack development was there, here also machine learning was AIML there, there it is, here it is machine learning. If you see elective was professional elective courses, open elective courses, both are here also and I will talk at the end what are those. And then project phase 1, machine learning lab and same set of some, you know things are there in as CSC. Now if you see in the 7th semester like same big data analytics, parallel computing, information and network security and then 3 elective subjects like professional elective, open elective and pro major project phase 2. And this is the time also when your placement starts in right. So these subjects are there to brush up. And now you see the 8th semester right. So, uh, you know, subjects like professional electives are there mostly and uh, open electives are there and you also do internship of 14 to 20 weeks, right? So, in the last semester is mostly the internship part of it. 
now i am talking about the professional electives one right where you have option from you have to choose from one of these which is agile technology java programming advanced computer architecture or data science and visualization so based on the uh, you know fixed subjects you can select the optional subjects like this and from the open elective side again you have so many options data structure dbms cyber security programming in java you can select one of those similarly in some some semester there was a professional elective 2 then there you can select subject from this one object oriented modeling digital image processing or cryptography network security blockchain internet of things based on your interest you can select subject from one of this under the professional elective bucket 3 there will be subjects like software architecture design deep learning robotic process or automation which is rpa and no sql databases so again you can select one of these and under the open electives 2 they will be again offered programs from to the other departments like py programming in python ai ml big data and data science so you can again go and select one of these and the other packet which is the professional elective 4 again here subjects are available options like mobile computing advanced computer architecture no sql database again based on your previous choices you can select one of these so that's all overall semester wise i have covered all the subjects which you are going to study in different parts of computer science csc btech course right so that's all and i will cover for all other branches as well thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates on all other branches syllabus as well take care and bye